Valley families this weekend are finding new ways to celebrate Halloween with tricks and treats and coronavirus precautions. Dish Channel 3 is Jake and Gracia live at home tonight with more on the socially distanced celebrations. Jake, where's the halo? John, I gave you all the previews you're going to get last night. Uh, as I said, no hints on what I'm going to be for Halloween this year. But trick-or-treating this year is strongly discouraged by uh, the county public health officials. However, there are trunk-or-treat events that are socially distanced that will allow you and your family to safely celebrate Halloween. It's Halloween. You know, it's, it's a night that everybody can imagine, you know, and be something. You know, sometimes you can't be yourself in everyday life, and Halloween, I think, is that one holiday where you can. Brian Jackson, one of the organizers at the haunted Halloween drive through trunk or treat event Friday night at the James O. Jesse Desert Highland Unity Center in Palm Springs. Volunteers giving out candy, using socially distanced poles, bringing some of the Halloween spirit to Valley kids, some who wait all year for the holiday. They've been locked up for so long, and they've had nothing to do apart from maybe schoolwork online, and, you know, this is something they all look forward to all oh, year, so they need to get out and do something. In addition to that contactless candy delivery, there are also a number of socially distanced games being played here at the drive through The kids able to throw those balls from right inside their car. At Earhart Elementary School Friday afternoon in Indio, a say boo to drugs, candy giveaway, and drive through haunted booth. Come on, say boo to drugs! Teachers and staff in costume, hoping to stay connected to their students amid the pandemic. Uh, we're building community at a time like this for everybody with distance learning. We still want to stay connected. So we're doing social distancing, say, staying safe um, and uh, coming together. This house in Desert Hot Springs offering another highly decorated drive through opportunity. With COVID and all the stress everybody's going through, we thought it would be a good idea to do this for the community. We've had a lot of cars just drive by. They stay in their car. Um, they drive by, look at the display and just want everybody to be safe, but have fun at the same time. Spooks and scares, but safe. Now, another trunk or treat happening tomorrow afternoon at the River Outdoor Mall in Rancho Mirage, 4 to 7 p.m. And our own News Channel 3 breaking news tracker will be on scene with some of the best treats out there. Guys, back here live, I just got to say I am so glad that Halloween is tomorrow because my candy bucket is about fresh out of Kit Kats. Back to you. Oh, no. Say it ain't so. I feel badly for you, Jake.